everyone. As expected, it is a very chilly start out there this morning, but at least we are nice and dry looking at the current conditions there at I-75 at Michigan Street. This is down south towards Sydney. Very quiet start to today, but it is cold. Temperature 34 degrees in Ottawa, 36 in the Fiance. And again, most areas have fallen between about 35 to around 40 degrees. The good news is for a lot of our area, we have seen the humidity stay low enough thanks to a light breeze that has really limited the chance to get any frost. So a lot of us not seeing frost because of that, but it is possible if you live in kind of a sheltered area here away from that wind, we could see a little bit of frost out there right now, but we've got a forecast that looks really good today. Now the sky probably won't look as blue as what this uh, background picture shows because we've got this wildfire haze in the upper atmosphere. It's from wildfires burning in western parts of Canada. We saw that yesterday, so it'll look very similar again today, but look at what happens to our temperature. We are going to warm up so fast all the way to 58 degrees by 11 a.m. and we just keep climbing this afternoon. We're going to see temperatures at 72 degrees by 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. this evening with hazy sunshine. Not much wind today so it will not be as breezy. So with the sunshine it'll actually feel pretty warm once we get into this afternoon. So that sky cast showing a very quiet day today. Again kind of hazy out there this afternoon. We'll stay dry as we go into tonight and with that wind you notice out of the south as we get into tomorrow morning that will keep those temperatures quite elevated tonight. So Friday morning we're going to start off here between about 54 to about 57 degrees. It'll be a really nice start Friday morning and tomorrow's one of those days where it heats up very quick in the morning already pushing the upper 70s to around 80 by early afternoon and we even notice some sunshine out there for the first half of our Friday. So even though we have rain in the forecast tomorrow, it's really not until late in the day. So a lot of tomorrow, decent weather with that wind out of the southwest, a bit on the breezy side. And again, that's going to pump in that warm air tomorrow afternoon. We'll start to see a better chance of showers, especially after 5 p.m. tomorrow. And scattered showers become more numerous for the evening hours. There's 9 p.m. Uh, heavier or I should say steadier showers off to the west. That will start to roll in overnight. By the time we get to Saturday morning, Right around 6 a.m., everything's starting to move out, and we should see a drying trend just in the nick of time for a dry day on Saturday. Looking at that forecast as we go through the weekend, not looking too shabby at all. After some rain tomorrow night, we'll clear things out on Saturday. Breezy, our high 67. We're back up to 75 degrees on Sunday. That seven-day forecast, again, the only rain we have is Friday evening and Friday night, and even that will only be around a quarter inch in most spots, so not a lot of rain. We could really use more of that, but we look forward into next week. We've got a lot of sunshine, a warmer forecast, highs in the 70s each day starting Sunday, and we have 80s starting next Wednesday and up to 85 by a week from today.